Hey, today I'm diving straight into Rust Desk, your open source, secure, remote desktop hero. <laughs> Stick around and by the end, you'll know whether it's the right team viewer style solution for you. Rust Desk is a remote desktop app built in Rust, running everywhere, Windows, Mac OS, Linux, Android, iOS, even web. So it works with pretty much any setup. It's end-to-end -end encrypted out of the box, so your connections are locked down tight. Here's what I love. You can use the public Rust Desk servers for free, no tricks. Want total data control? Spin up your own self-hosted server. A basically PS handles hundreds of sessions with ease. Users on Reddit are running it on Pi or low-cost VPS at virtually zero expense. The UI is intuitive. You punch in a remote ID or connect direct IP on your LAN, hit connect, done. You get file transfer, clipboard sync, chat, multi-monitor support, even session recording. Codec support is solid too with VP8, VP9, even AV1, and hardware decoding where available. If you need more than personal use, Rust Desk Server Pro adds enterprise-grade tools. LDAP, 2FA, audit logs, web client, OIDC, custom branding. Pricing starts at about $10 monthly for individuals and scales if you add users or devices. Rock solid for small teams or businesses wanting self-hosted control. Trade-offs? You'll have to handle your own server if privacy is key. And some dev-level features can feel a bit techy to set up. But once it's running, it's silky smooth. So, who's Rust Desk for? If you want a lean, cross-platform remote desktop that's open source, encrypted, and can run entirely under your roof or on a cheap VPS, Rust Desk nails it. If you run a small team and want pro features like LDAP, session logs, and centralized control, not to mention no wild SaaS costs, Server Pro is a smart pick. Bottom line, Rust Desk is a powerful, privacy-first remote desktop built for both tech-savvy users and small teams. If you're cool managing a server, you'll save money and own your data. If you crave zero config simplicity for personal use, the free version works great. Give it a try. You might ditch TeamViewer for good.